This is Alex Nye, Instructional Technologist at the Community College of Aurora. In this video, we will look at the content area of D2L's courses. The content area is where you will find all of the instructional materials posted by your instructor. Each course has its own content area that you will want to explore at the start of each semester. Inside, you might find documents, PowerPoints, videos, links to activities, and any other materials relevant to the course. To access the content area of a course, click on the link to the course's homepage in your My Courses list. The content area is accessed by clicking on the content link at the top of the page. The first page you are brought to in the content area is the table of contents. On this page you will get an overview of all the content available in your course. To get a more detailed look at a specific area, use the menu on the left to select the unit or area of the course you are interested in. In this sample course, all of our materials for Unit 1 are located in this area. Clicking on the links will open up the assignments, documents, and videos the instructor has posted in this area. When you are in a content item, you can always return to the previous area by using the menu at the top of the page. If one of the content items in your course is a document or a PowerPoint, as in the case of this atomic bomb PowerPoint, when you click on the link, it will open up the PowerPoint in a new window. At the bottom of the page, you can also download and save the PowerPoint file. I'm going to return to the previous page to look at how to download everything in a course unit. To do this, when you're inside a unit, you have a download button at the top. This will zip all of the content items in this unit and allow you to save it on your computer for offline viewing. After you've saved the zip file, you can return to its location on your computer to open and view the documents. I'm going to return to the Unit 1 overview to demonstrate the print function in D2L. To print a content item, you'll notice that you have a print option at the top of the page. Then all you must do is select your printer and click OK to print the document on the screen. I hope this look at D2L's content area has been helpful. Try exploring the content of your own courses in D2L. You may find that even in your on-ground classes, your instructor is posting content. 